Hello you pre-cum soaked parcels of Penny Pasta, Jim Sterling here, and this is Karma Flow, the rock opera video game. I have been somewhat excited to play this one uh, because it's called the rock opera video game, and I'm assuming that will make it brilliant. So we're going to do a new game here. All your progress, well I've not played it before so I don't really care. Let's go. Okay, here we go. Yes. Mixed reviews on Steam. Which... Oh, oh. Okay, we'll try that again. Mixed reviews on Steam. Um, I'm not sure why, but I've been hoping... Yeah, I saw it um, on, up for pre-release the other day and, and was kind of excited for it. Um, just because I'm a big fan of the, uh, the concept of musical video games. We're going to try this again. The cons... As time okay. Well, that worked. What the hell? Hang on. Headphones aren't plugged in. Right. Sorry. Okay, now I can hear things properly. Okay. So, starting with the sing song. There aren't enough musical video games. That's what I'm saying. Wonderful. Okay, so that was that was the beginning of the rock opera. I said I'm a, I'm a big fan of the concept of musical video games. There aren't many. Um, the only one I really played to any great degree was uh, the Nightmare Before Christmas: Oogie's Revenge, which was um, written as a full sequel to the Nightmare Before Christmas. Okay, so we're this thing. We've got a double jump going on. That's about it. But yeah, had some original songs and reworked versions of songs from the movie. Uh, including boss fights that had some rhythm, like like rhythm sections, as well as general third-person platformy combat. And the uh, Sally's... Ward, Sally's creator, Professor, whose name I can't remember now. Um, the fella in the wheelchair with the hatch on his head and he, um, you know, opens it and his brain's there. He had a full song in Oogie's Revenge. Okay, well, that doesn't do anything. So, after that uh, climactic beginning, very slow, there we go, very slow start. Got ourselves a dash going on. Okay. So yeah. Um, I know there was um, wasn't there some DS game that was a musical. The name escapes me now. Names of things are escaping me today. Oh, hello. Okay, so we picked that up and got a bit of a sing-song as a reward. Let's see if there are subtitles. Let's 
say. I use the mouse for this. And then this would have been video. Audio. No. We'll look in video again quickly. Resolution and duct field um, new game. Sense no, okay, but well, it's telling us to extract anyway. Okay. We're using the extraction to take the cover from an object. Okay. So we got that. I guess. Oh, right, I'll go grab this as well then. Hold the extract button to extract cover while moving. Okay. Right. Purple glow indicates an object contains no karma. Gotcha. Number on your back shows make karma need. One. Using a fuse can give you karma to an object. You got it, son. There you go. What do you think of that? Alright, I think I'm work this out. Okay, so pick up a thing from a thing, give it to a thing, and a thing will happen. Got that nice and worked out. Okay, okay. Fun times. Let's continue on our merry way. Fairly simple. Hmm. I think so. I have to stand on it first. There we go. That's a little uh, visually confusing with him floating and that floating and there looking weird like he could fall at any moment but we got up there Yeah, camera swinging all over the place. But we will go and get this. Then back to the beaten path. Okay, I guess that was an enemy there. And we've uh, frozen it. So that's a thing that you can do. Why does it keep spinning back? Like the camera just keeps spinning behind and forcing me to look backwards. It's annoying. I'd rather it not happen. Alright, what you doing? Okay. Time for another sing song.
Glide, press and hold. Simple. Oh, no, the camera's taking control from me again. Good, good. Okay, the camera can really rain its bollocks in on this one. It just, it loves to fucking slide around when I'm trying to do shit. Bit less of that. Some of those weird crocodile things would start a little song. Nothing. It's just sat there. Fair dues. Shit now. I guess that's a path there. There we go. Okay, so if I just pop over here and then glide along, I should hit safe ground. There we go. Oh, fuck. Couldn't see nothing. Oh, now we know what that is. We are learning lessons. Lessons, dear friend. Right, we'll be a bit more careful this time. Come here. Nice fucking try. Get away from me. One would assume this gets a bit more complex as we uh, have to start putting things to and from stuff rather than just take and give sequentially. Anyway, what have you lit up? What am I seeing? Over there. Have we been there before? I can't even tell. Some monster dude up there. Okay, that didn't do anything. Oh no. I suppose there's nothing. Nothing to lose from giving it a try. Oh, well, almost. Try that again. 
We'll, we'll try something again. Try to work out what it is I'm missing. That looks like the only, that's the only other thing. Oh, wait. Oh, wait, no, that's just... Just the continue thing. Like, I guess that could be something. Nope. Let me just go through it. I'm gonna try this one more go. There we go. Great song, but now what the fuck? Okay, I think I've gone the right way now. Went back to the apple bit and I didn't notice this little jump down here. So, here we are, back on the trail. Things looking good. What the fuck? Okay, that was supposed to happen. Good, I think. Oh, there we go. Now what? Got another uh, continue there. Oh! Nice! The villains always get the best songs. Uh oh. What, what the hell? Okay. Well, that was a thing. Well, my guess is like the things, like the lights. He seems to, uh, that would be my guess for what to do here. Could be wrong. Yeah, well, that looks like that did something. Take that back. This way. Went the wrong way. She went around the side somewhere, didn't she? Where did she fuck off to?
It's around here somewhere. Anyway, whatever. It was a good juncture to end it. Um, I may go back and revisit this. Maybe on a live thing, or at least to review it for the Jimquisition.com, which is a website. Because um, it's interesting. You know, it's quite interesting. In a weird way. I mean, I can certainly see why it's got mixed reviews. It's a little bit... Meh. There we go. I needed to not take that thing. Anyway, I'm going to head off. And that'll be a thing. So, yeah. That's Karma Flow, the rock opera video game. With a little fella. And some singing. Yeah. Cool. Good.